folks and welcome to another adventures of scott michelle today's adventure takes you to downtown elmhurst i'm going to be showing you uh what downtown elmhurst has and uh taking you on a little adventure so join me so now across the street from where i'm standing here in downtown elmhurst um Usually uh, across the way they have like a little nice little fountain over there and sometimes they uh, have like a little uh, band and some music and people perform there. Um, also right across the street you have your Chipotle and you have your Dairy Queen. Um, Chipotle is okay, it's not too bad but yeah. Yeah, and this place I've never been to, but it's called Sushi Nest. So if you're into sushi, this might be a good place. But I've uh, never tried it out. And across the way is Buffalo Wow Wings. I really, really love their wings. And on Tuesdays, they have a special where you buy one, uh, you get one for half price. So it's a pretty good deal. And this right here is Kilowin's Chocolate Fudge Ice Cream. I've never tried their ice cream out, but I heard it's pretty, pretty good. Um, so, never tried it out, but you know, I heard it's rather good. Now this right here, folks, is the York Theater. I've been coming here for years, um, ever since it was like $1.75. I remember coming here when I was a teenager and seeing like tons and tons of movies. Um, I think I've seen the movie Bird on a Wire. Um, that was a really, really good movie. So I remember seeing seeing that movie here, and I think I only paid like a dollar seventy-five for it. Uh, but right now they have a special going on Tuesdays where um, it's five dollars all day. And I just saw the new movie with Nicolas Cage. Excellent movie. So if you haven't seen it, you would really want to check that out. So yeah, this is a really, really good theater. It's been here for a long time. And you get like free refills on your popcorn and on your drinks. So it's like $5 all day, can't beat it. Um, got really nice reclining seats in there. Um, even also have uh, like a button for like, if it's like too cold and you wanna warm yourself, they got like butt warmer seats. Oh, and Top Gun, I can't wait to see that. That looks like it's gonna be a really excellent movie, so. I'm gonna definitely have to check that out here. So this is the York Theater, and I've been coming here for years. Um, I really, really love this theater. Um, it's one of my favorite theaters to go to to see a movie. So I actually love this movie theater. So yeah, this is a really, really good, nice movie theater. It's only like five bucks a person on Tuesdays all day. And um, really, really nice movie theater. And then up here on the movie screen, they show you like what movies are playing and what the times are. Or you can just, you know, Google it on your phone and just look up Classic Cinema's York Theater too as well. This is the Bazzy Fun Bath and Treat, so you can get like all your stuff for your bath, whatever. Um, this is a really neat and cool little shop too. And then right here, um, they have a, uh, a little, another restaurant. Um, I guess it's like uh, you get strawberry bowls. Um, never ever been in here but um, I heard it's pretty good it opened up not too long ago so definitely gonna have to try that out sometime and then right here you have your Starbucks coffee so if you really are into coffee and you like Starbucks they have one right down here in downtown Elmhurst now also down here in downtown Elmhurst we have a subway uh, been there many of times uh, to get sandwiches and uh, pretty nice place uh, they also have a, a place you can get your nails done 
And also here in downtown Elmhurst, they also have an Egg Harbor Cafe. Oh my God. This place is like so wonderful for breakfast. So if you've never been to an Egg Harbor, Egg Harbor Cafe, sorry, um, this is this would be a really nice place to go to. Um, I definitely would highly, highly recommend a Carper Cafe for breakfast. I mean, they have wonderful food, and it's you never you never leave hungry. And then right across the street, you have your typical um, grocery store. There's a Jewel Asco too. Now this place right across the street um, is sort of like an Italian restaurant. Um, I've never been there, um, but I would like to try it out someday. It's just that it doesn't um, actually go with our diet since we've been doing keto, so yeah. But one day I will definitely have to try that out. And it's just it's a really nice, beautiful, gorgeous day. It's like in the 90s today. Um, it's like, uh, you know, May 10th, and it's like, I can't believe they don't have the fountain on, but that's a really beautiful fountain. I mean, it's a gorgeous day, too. It's like, I want to say it's like 90, 93, but it's like a beautiful day outside. And they also have community. They also have some really nice, uh, unique little gift shops, too, in uh, downtown Elmhurst as well. Oh wow, these are some really cool pants. <laughs> now I know um, on Fridays they do have like a trolley that will take you around uh, downtown Elmhurst. Um, it doesn't cost anything and um, I believe it is, uh, I'm not too sure when they run, like what the times are, but I know they do them on Fridays. I'm not too sure if they're still doing that you know still doing that right now but I did uh, happen to see one uh, one Friday when I was up here in downtown Elmer so um, yeah it's pretty cool that they do that and then right directly across the street is the uh, Elmhurst train station you could actually take that train all the way to uh, downtown Chicago yeah, so you would just hop on that train and it would take you all the way to uh, downtown Chicago. Not too sure how much the uh, fare costs. I'm not too sure on that and like what, what time the times run. But yeah, you could take that train all the way to downtown uh, Chicago if you wanted to. And uh, this place is uh, called Beerhead Bar and Eatery. Um, they have really good, really good food, I heard, in there. Like, the burgers are really good, so. Gonna have to try that out. And this, oh my god, this hot place has really, really good pizza. Armandas. Oh my god, they have really, really good pizza there. Now, directly across the street is a place called Red Dragon. Um, if you're looking for a good place to go for Chinese food, I would highly recommend that place. That place is really good Chinese food and it's relatively inexpensive. I love that place. And then right directly across the street, we have Gem, Gem Comics. Um, it's a place where they sell all kinds of different types of comic books and stuff like that. And right over here they have a music store. And then right next door to it is a GMC barbershop. So you can get your hair done. 
and a haircut, whatever you like. Now, right in here, folks, this used to be where Pizza Palace um, used to be. Um, I've been going there for years upon years. Ever since I was a teenager, I grew up going there. It used to be my hangout spot. I go there with my nephew and yeah it was just a fun little place and I also went there with my husband several times too they had this really nice uh, little jukebox in there where you can play music and they had all this old music you can play like from the 80s and it was just a fun place to go and have pizza um, and then I think on Fridays they would have a guy uh, in there and he would play music like on a guitar and stuff so it was a really nice place and ah oh man they had the best pizza it was so good but yeah they uh, closed down so they're no longer in business anymore it's pretty sad yep this is where pizza palace used to be right here no longer and then I remember in this building right next to uh, where pizza palace used to be this used to be like um a trip like a hobby shop so yeah this used to be a hobby shop uh, they used to sell like model trains and stuff in here um, but right now they no longer do that anymore and I believe it closed down so yeah now it's just like a realty company so um, yeah they sell realty here um, instead of like model trains um, I believe I did buy my uh, nephew uh, HO scale train set uh, back when he was real little and he really loved it and then here is Elmhurst Coins and Collectibles. Um, I guess you can take your old coins here, uh, I guess, to sell. So I just love downtown Elmhurst. It's a really nice place to go and just walk around. They have a lot of neat shops in uh, downtown Elmhurst, as well as a nice uh, movie theater. And also this place that I'm coming up to that I'm going to be showing you is called Kreps. Oh my god, I absolutely love this place. They have really, really good breakfast food. Um, so if you're into crops, I would definitely recommend coming to this place. Um, they have really, really good crops. Oh my god, they are so good.